Hello friends and welcome to a lecture on Python. Today we will learn how to solve a second order differential equation numerically using Python. So let's go ahead with it. The differential equation is on your screen. It is d square y by dx square plus dy by dx minus 6y is equal to 0. Now this equation uh, has a value of y at 0 as 5 and dy by dx at x is equal to 0 as minus 5. Now to solve it in Python, we have to write the second order differential equation as two first order differential equations. So what do we do for that? We replace dy by dx as z and then we get dz by dx is equal to 6y minus z. Now these are two first order differential equations which are solved simultaneously to get the answer for y. For this, what do we do now? We import our libraries. So the libraries that we need to import is scipy integrate. From scipy integrate, we have to import ode int. We import matplotlib to plot our results and we also import numpy. So, Let's reset it. So let's restart and run all. That should not be a problem. Okay. Now let's get to the second cell. Now here what we do is first we define our model. So define model, our model for differential equation. So write define model. You can choose any name, what do you want, whatever you want. So I'll write second order differential equation and the Inputs for this function are going to be the dependent variable followed by the independent variable. Now, y comma z initially is going to be y. So that is, it will be obvious and it will be very clear in a little while. The y that we read is going to be a vector of two numbers which are going to be the initial conditions and these are going to be the initial conditions for y and z. And now we define our differential equation. So we write dy by dx is equal to the two differential equations are going to be one is going to be z and of course the second differential equation is going to be 6. z okay so there we are and we have to return dy dx remember one thing the lhs here is only a symbol for the lhs of differential equation this does imply that the first equation is dy by dx is equal to z and the second equation is dz by dx is equal to 6y minus z. So we run this. After that, we have to create a vector for our input. So x is our input. x is equal to numpy dot lin space from 0 to 1. That is, we want the value from 0 to 1 for which the differential equation should be solved numerically for x and we want to solve it at 100 points. Mind you, this is not the step size. The step size is taken internally by the solver itself. So we do that and now we finally proceed towards the solution. So we write solution is equal to O D E I N T int. First we write the model for which we want the solution. This is followed by the initial vectors which is phi comma minus phi and then we write the input x for which we want the solution for y. We run it. So it's done now. Now let's plot our results. So plt dot plot. x comma solution all the values in the row of solution and 0. So as you can see we have got our solution. Now is this solution right? 
that's the whole question right so what we have done here what i have done here is i have found the particular solution for this differential equation and this is nothing but y is equal to 2 e raised to 2 x plus 3 e raised to minus 3 x so just make a slight correction here it is minus 3 x it is not 3 x okay so let's plot the equation now so we write p l t dot plot so let's leave it there and let's make another plot for it so first we calculate the values of y so the value of y is going to be 2 star np dot exp Two x plus np dot exp that is for exponential minus three x and this is also multiplied by three so there we are now we have the values of y so we take it as y y so let's run all this once again to reset things. right so now let's plot x comma y y and let's see what do we get and as you can see we get a similar curve now if i replot on this axis and that too in green let's see as you can see the blue and the green lines match therefore the solution that we have got numerically is exactly equal to the particular solution that we had found by analysis so that's a very short tutorial on how we solve a second order differential equation numerically using python Hope you have enjoyed this video and if you have any queries, do write in the comment box. I shall be too glad to attend to them. And yes, do keep watching my channel. Have a great day. Have a great time.